Alright guys, we're ready to do double jeopardy now. I have the lead with $7,600. Player 2 has $2,800 and player 3 has minus $800. So let's get to it. Player 3 is in third place. Which means, of course, player 3 will select first in double jeopardy. Oh, we get some good clues here. Let's see what happens in Double Jeopardy with these categories awaiting the players. Physical science. Physical science. The arts. The arts. The cinema. The cinema. Historic Munich. Historic Munich. Beastly expressions. Beastly expressions and, and libraries. libraries. Okay. A lot of clues, a lot of categories, player three. Make of this country's national library. The Bibliotheca Nacional José Martí was financed by a tax on sugar. I'm gonna try it. Player one. What is Mexico? No. No. Sorry. Anyone else want to hazard a guess on this? The correct response is Cuba. Cuba is the answer, okay. The Hector Fodler Library in Rotterdam, which is devoted to this artificial language, has over 15,000 books. Okay, player two. Right, you are. It's Esperanto, okay. Okay, let's get back into this. Player two, you make the next selection. When his presidential library was dedicated in 1991, four former presidents were in attendance. I'll try it. Let's hear it, player one. Who is Ronald Reagan? Yeah. You're right. And I'm going to get out of that category. Let's go with brief, beastly expressions before I Curiosity killed this animal. Okay, player one. Was the cat? <laughs> Beefly expressions for Ann. On Cheers, Norm said it was this kind of world, and I'm wearing milk bone underwear. Let's hear it, player one. What is a dog eat dog world? That's it. Player Beefly one. expressions for 12 years. To but smug is to look like the cat that ate this bird. With the canary. Player one. That is correct. Player one. Pick a game. And I got the daily double. Yeah. The first of the two daily doubles. And you have the lead. Twelve hundred dollars. Player one. Here is your clue. To cry these is to show insincere sorrow. I could have bid more. With crocodile tears. You have maintained your lead. Here you go. You get to pick again. 2000. This porcine phrase refers to something of undetermined value as a purchase. Yes, player one. What is pig in a poke? Wow. You again, player one. Let's go with the physical science of 400. All five elements of the salt-producing halogen group end in these three letters. One element purifies drinking water. I'm going to try it. Yes, player one. What is... G-E-N? Oh. No. no. Anyone else care to try to come up with a correct response? Here is the correct response. I N E. I N E, okay. Please pick again. Hey, Andrew. It's the lightest known stable subatomic particle. The correct response is electron. With electron, okay. Please pick well, up. Uh, Microscopic substances have a tendency to absorb this from the atmosphere. Ah! 
Okay, player two. Aww. Sorry. Not oxygen. I'm going to go for Anybody it. Else want to hazard a guess on this? I'll throw a guess out there. Okay, player one. What is hygro? Hygro. With heat? Oh. Okay, it's moisture, Dan. Anyone else want to hazard a guess on this? Yes, player three. Yeah. Good. Back on the plus side. A lot of clues, a lot of categories, player three. Make us a, a body at rest will remain at rest unless acted upon by a force according to Newton's law of this property. I should know this. Yes, player one. What is, uh... With inertia. Whoa. A lot of clues. 2000. Here's Sarah to start us off. Nuclear fusion in the sun's core produces energy that eventually flows to the photosphere. First by radiation and then by heat currents. Using this process, also used in a type of oven. Here's the response we were looking for. Convection. Convection, okay. We return to you, player Let's one. go with uh, Historic Munich for 400. In Munich's coat of arms, you'll find one of these religious figures who originally settled the city and gave it its name. Okay, player one. What is the monk? Okay. Hey. You again, player Historic one. Munich for Henry. His motto used to be Die Weltstadt mit Herz. The world city with this. We're talking about heart. Okay, the world city with heart. We return to you, player one. In 1634 one. and 1635, this deadly contagion devastated Munich killing more than one-third of its residents. Player one. What is the bubonic plague? Yeah. Player one. Six, the Summer Olympics in Munich in this year were sadly marred by terrorism and tragedy. It's player two. Oops. All right. 1972. Player two, you're in command of the board as we continue, right? In the 16th century, Munich was a center of the German phase of this movement against Protestantism. Here's the correct response. The Counter Reformation. With the Counter Reformation, okay. Player two, pick again. We them up for 400. 45 years before Disney, Jean Cocteau made a live action version of this film with Josette Day as Belle. Player one. With the Little Mermaid. Oh. Any other take? Oh, shoot! It's Beauty and the Beast. I just thought of it. Here's the correct response. Beauty and the Beast. We return to you, player two. The Gobelin factory of France was famous for these wall hangings and began manufacturing them around 1600. Player one. What are... Painting. Nope. Anyone else care to try to come up with a correct response? The correct response is tapestries. You again, player two. This Shakespeare library, named for this standard oil man, is run by Amherst College. Player three. Good for you. With Henry Folger, okay. 
Player three, starting. The Radcliffe Camera, Britain's first round library, is the main reading room of this bigger library at Oxford. Player two. Nope. Anyone else care to try to come up? With I'll take a guess. It's player one. Where's the Rowling symbol library? No. Any other takers? Let's hear it, player three. <laughs> okay. The gap is closer. Pick again. This author of Time and of Athens was part owner of London's Blackfriars Theatre. Okay, player three. Any other takers? Okay, player one. Who is Ben Johnson? Sorry. Oh. William Shakespeare, huh? Anyone else want to hazard a guess on this? Okay, player two. Good for you. Player two, where do we start? Beginning around 1790 in New York City, Duncan Fife was a leader in the artful manufacturing of this. We're talking about furniture. With furniture, okay. Please pick again, player two. His portrait of Jonathan Bahal is known as the Blue Boy. Here's the response we were looking for. Thomas Gainsborough. You again, player two. Let's go over to Kelly. Beginning around 447 BC, Phidias supervised the making of the sculptures for this ancient structure. We're talking about the Parthenon. Oh, it's the Parthenon, okay. Select again. This 2001 title role was meant for Emily Watson. But she didn't speak French. Audrey Tattoo got the part. These clues are getting difficult. Okay, player three. That's correct. With Emily. Okay, let's get back into this. Player three, you make the next selection. He gets the daily double. That's it. The other daily double. Your second place, so what is your wager going to be? Player three, give us here is your clue. This star of Chocolat and the English Patient made her film debut in the 1982 French film Liberty Bell. I'm fine. Player three, choose again. In 1956, Roger Vadim directed his first film, And God Created Woman, which starred this actress, his then wife. One more clue left. I think we'll finish it the within 15 minutes. Bridget Bardo. With Bridget Bardo, okay. And now the $2,000 clue. This director, son of a famous impressionist painter, is perhaps best known for his 1937 film, Grand Illusion. I think I ran away with this one. All right, guys, it's my game to lose again. We'll be back with the final Jeopardy round when we come back. Stay tuned.